Hello, welcome to Valve channel. I'm Stephen. In ball valve industry, the most important component for the ball valve to seal the pressure inside the flow control system is the valve seat or the valve sealing face. The ball will cooperate with the valve seat to seal the pressure. In different flow control system, it will have different flow media. So valve design engineer will going to design different valve seat or different uh, ball valve sealing face to seal the pressure by different uh, material. So in this video, we are talking about five different uh, ball valve sealing face in ball valve industry for different uh, flow media in the flow control system. First kind of valve seat is one kind of soft seat ball valve valve seat. This kind of white color valve seat are very widely used in soft seat ball valve industry. Most of the time we were going to use PTFE or RTFE to make this kind of valve seat. This kind of valve seat, the advantages is because this kind of material are very soft. So when we're going to assembling this kind of valve seat and the ball inside the valve body, when we're going to compress the valve seat with the ball, this kind of cooperation are very easily to seal the pressure inside the flow control system. But the disadvantages is because the valve seat are very soft. So if the flow medium are not so pure, if the flow medium contained a little particle inside, the particle may grab the valve seat. It can make the valve leak. So engineers are looking for another kind of material which is a little bit harder then this kind of soft seat material and also the material is elastic material. So let's look at what kind of material had that kind of property. So in ball valve industry, the soft seat except this kind of white color, we also have some other color. Those kind of different color valve seat are coming from the RTFE. Because RTFE are so soft, we want to improve the RTFE hardness and also we want this kind of material can work in high temperature environment. So engineer had one idea which is we mix other kind of material with TFE to make new kind of material. First one is carbon with carbon mix with TFE to make one kind of valve seat. The color is black. It's black color. And another is TFE mix with stainless steel to make one kind of valve seat which is gray color. So those kind of mixed material valve seat had two advantages than the RTFE. One is the material can work in high temperature flow control system than before. And another is the material hardness are much better than before. The material are much harder than the RTFE. So the particle inside the flow media are not so easier to break the valve seat compared with the RTFE. So those two kinds of material is another kind of valve seat in soft seat ball valve industry. We already talked about two kinds of valve seat in soft seat ball valve industry. Soft ball valve is one kind of valve which is very easy to get zero leakage function because the valve seat is one kind of elastic material. But this kind of design had one disadvantage, which is if the fire occurred, the fire can totally destroy the valve seat. So if one manufactures a flow control system or use soft seat ball valve, if the fire occur, all the flow medium will get leak. So that will be very dangerous. So engineer want to design one kind of valve seat, which is soft seat, but also it has fire safety design. So let's talk about what is fire safety design. In soft seat ball valve industry, whatever what kind of material you are going to use to make the valve seat, if the fire occur, the high temperature will totally destroy the valve seat. The valve will get leak. So that will be a very dangerous situation. So in soft seat ball valve industry, one kind of design are very important, which is called a fire safety design. So let's look at what is fire safety design. Here is the original valve seat, which is cooperated with the ball to seal the pressure. When the fire occurs, the high temperature totally destroys the original valve seat. 
because the flow control system still has pressure inside. The pressure will push the ball flow to the downside. So valve design engineer designed second valve seat. Actually, this second valve seat is one part of the valve body. So it is metal. It will not be destroyed by the high temperature. And also, this second valve seat, the seating face are very narrow. So it is very easy to cooperate with the ball to see the pressure inside the flow control system. Even though in this condition, when the pressure push the ball to cooperate with the second valve seat to see the pressure inside the flow control system, the valve cannot operate again. But at least the flow median inside the flow control system is still safe. So this kind of design we call the fire safety design. Before the fire, the original valve seat cooperated with the ball to seal the pressure, so seal the flow media inside the flow control system. After the fire and during the fire, the second sealing phase was going to cooperate with the ball to seal the pressure, to seal the flow media inside the flow control system. So the flow media is still safe inside the flow control system. So this kind of design we call a fire safety design. Next, let's talk about the metal seat ball valve. When we're talking about metal seat in ball valve industry, actually we have two kinds of metal seat. One is this kind of metal seat. Here is the valve seat, which is totally made by metal. The spring was going to push the seat to touch the ball to seal the pressure. But actually the sealing face, the valve seat, which the area going to touch the ball are not made by metal because we were going to insert a soft material inside the valve seat. This area was going to touch the ball to seal the pressure inside the flow control system. So the metal seat, just a frame, which is going to protect the real valve seat to touch the ball to seal the pressure. This kind of design always works in very big size ball valve, because when the valve size are very big, the soft material are very easily to be break. So we were going to use a very big metal seat to protect the soft material inside. And this area we're going to cooperate with the ball to seal the pressure inside the flow control system. The next metal seat is the true metal seat ball valve. The valve seat are totally made by metal. And the metal seat will cooperate with the metal ball to seal the pressure inside the flow control system. So this kind of design, this kind of ball valve can work in very high temperature and very high pressure environment. But this kind of design are very difficult to produce because a little bit of deviation on ball or on the valve seat will make the valve leak. Because the valve seat are totally made by metal, so the ball must be harder than the valve seat. If the ball are softer than the valve seat, the valve seat will scratch the ball, the valve will leak. And in valve design, whatever what kind of valve you're going to design, the ceiling face, the wider ceiling face must be harder than the narrower ceiling face. So the narrower ceiling face will not going to damage the wider ceiling face. The wider ceiling face will never going to damage the narrower ceiling face because the wider ceiling face are totally cover the narrow ceiling face. So that is the very basic principle in valve design. This metal seat ball valve are a little bit special because it designed two lines for the valve seat sitting face. So the two line sitting face can make this valve sitting are more reliable. To make the ball are harder than the valve seat, most of the time we were going to use several different uh, treatment to make the ball are harder than the valve seat. I was going to make a video to talk about how to make a ball surface are harder than the valve seat. The last one is the lining ball valve. This kind of ball valve are very special than other kind of ball valve. In some kind of special flow control system, the flow media are very corrosive. We even cannot use metal to touch the flow media. So we are going to use PFA or PTFE or other kind of material going to totally cover the ball and also cover 
all the area which is going to touch the flow media inside the flow control system. So this kind of ball valve we call a lining ball valve. The ball are totally lined. We use PFA or other kinds of material going to totally cover the ball. And then the ball is going to cooperate with the valve seat to see the pressure inside the flow control system. So the ball will look like this. It is totally covered by the PFA. And then the ball will going to cooperate with the valve seat to see the pressure. So that is for today. Thank you for watching. See you next video. Bye bye.